Hello and welcome to another Nihongo Gamer video, but this time it's going to be kind of vlog style. I thought I would try something new and uh, do a vlog because I've just got these today. Um, this is the iPad Pro Smart Cover and the iPad Pro Silicon Case for the new 9.7 inch device. So I've got my old iPad Air 2 and it's actually going to release tomorrow, iPad Pro 9.7. So we don't even have the iPad Pro 9.7 yet, but the cases came in the post today, which means that we can actually test out the cases on an iPad Air 2. So, so um, while I'm just taking this case off of my old iPad Air, uh, I thought I'd just quickly explain what I'm thinking. Basically, there are a lot of videos that I think uh, might be a bit too short or a little bit um, unrelated to gaming or the you know general drawing stuff that I do on Nihongo Gamer, which is why I thought today uh, I would start this vlog channel and then have it a little bit kind of less edited, less processed, and uh, less just lots of less things. Anyway, uh, it's going to be a brand new channel. So if you're interested in seeing more casual stuff um, like this, ta -da, I've unboxed my yellow cover. And the reason I've actually gone for yellow is because um, the other one I got is this blue case, which is, I'm hoping, going to make it look kind of like the Indiana Pacers, which uh, when I was a kid, I was a fan of the, the Pacers basketball team. I don't really follow basketball much anymore. Okay, let's see if I can, oh! This is a very interesting cover. Now, I was actually not a big fan of these silicon cases before because over time, the oh, the like wax coating on the outside kind of rubs off and it ends up getting kind of grubby and sticky. So I, I'm, I'm not sure how this is going to work out in the long run, but iPad uh, Air 2, not iPad Pro, and iPad Pro 9.7 cases, let's see whether it actually fits in. Because uh, I don't even know why you might want to do this, but um, you might, I don't know, maybe if you're like saving money or something, you might want to uh, do something like this. Okay, so by the way, you can see the camera through the side there, and it is going to fit in. Oh, it's a, it feels, oh, it's a perfect, it's a perfect fit. Check that out. So this is the iPad Air 2 in gold sitting in uh, a blue iPad Pro 9.7 case with the, um, I'll just show you this here. So if it looks like I'm looking at the wrong color, color camera, I'm actually recording on my iPad Pro 12.9 right now. So that's what it looks like. There will be space for the extra flash, which is coming on the iPad Pro 9.7, but there you go. iPad Pro case for iPad Air 2 fits perfectly. The question is, will this magnet uh, actually work? And the answer is, oh, oh, it does. It works fine. I guess because these smart covers must be identical to the old iPad Air, Air covers. Ah, that's interesting. It doesn't, um, it doesn't, st <laughs> the magnet doesn't stick. That's weird. Okay, I guess that the magnet is now in a different place on the iPad Air 2. So this is important information. If you were going to buy an iPad Pro case, thinking that you might upgrade to an iPad Pro 9.7 in the future, you should know that this case does not magnetize to the, um, to the front of the device anymore. In fact, it doesn't even switch it on. Usually uh, I have it set to automatically switch on when you open the case, but it doesn't do that. If you, um, I'll just show you as a demonstration with this case and my old, my old iPad Air 2 case. Let's see if I just do this. I'll show you that the case when you uh, do this, it does switch on automatically. So off, on, the switch is on. And unfortunately, it doesn't do that with the, um, with the new case. Uh, let's see, will it switch off? No. So, this is important information, everybody. The case does not magnetize. Uh, but um, it does fit, so just keep in mind that if you are going to buy a case in preparation because you might upgrade in the future, then go ahead and buy the, the back case. It fits perfectly. Uh, there's absolutely no problem with that. Obviously, you've got the holes on the top as well as the holes on the bottom, which means that you're going to be prepared for when you have your iPad Pro 9.7 to have the sound come out. I think. Yeah, the speakers are in a slightly different position on the iPad Pro, so just checking, if you're just having a look at this, the speakers will be in a different place, so the holes only come up to here on the iPad 9.7, but they echo a little bit, they're quite a bit wider on the uh, iPad Pro 9.7. So, there you go. It fits, 
but it's uh, not ideal for the cover, uh, for the case. No, for the cover. So the cover, the cover is no good, but the case is fine. And uh, if you actually, if you don't mind the fact that it doesn't magnetize, then obviously you can go ahead and get yourself the cover as well. But that would bug me. Uh, so for now, I won't be using the uh, cover. Uh, okay, I won't be using the cover yet, but I, I would like to stick with this case. I think this case looks pretty good, uh, and it does fit perfectly, so no problem. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this uh, first Nihongo Gamer vlog. Um, I plan to make more of these, and it's also really nice that vlogs are much easier to create, so hopefully I can update. I don't know if I can actually update them sort of every single day, but I will try to upload um, as often as possible. So here you have it, Nihongo Gamer vlog number one. Obviously, don't forget to comment, subscribe, share the links, and all that good stuff. And I'll see you in a, a new Hungry Gamer video or on the next vlog video. She's got magnets on her feet. First new Nintendo 3DS game, Final Fantasy XV. Ah! Someone pick up the phone. How about you, Cloud? <laughs> it's shopping time. So I let her go in front of me, and she ran into the shop, and she took the only copy of this. And I thought. <laughs> Here it comes! Oh! It's like the anime, but better. It doesn't say what this is. It just, it just, it's just a piece of plastic. I, I really think, I think, I think maybe it, it is a frisbee. <laughs>